friends. Debbie here with Debbie Gets Crafty and happy Friday. I thought today we might, we worked on some purples, we worked on some pinks and yellows. Let's work on a little blue. We're going to work on this little gentleman's tail feathers right here. So let's get started. How are you today? It's Friday. Nobody's blue on a Friday, right? Except this little guy's tail, but that's okay. Let's go ahead and we'll lift this up. It's a beautiful off the canvas, off the canvas uh, image that I got from Craft Buddy. There we go. And we'll move. Listen, mister. Listen, mister. There we go. More than one way to take care of that. So let's bring you on in. There we go. And we'll move this aside. All right. So let's get started. We have the letter C. Oh, it's pretty deep blue. Okay. I like it. All right. Let's go. How are you today? I mean, we can't be all that bad. It's Friday, right? At least I'm not that bad. It's knowing that it's Friday. I'll take it. Which means we're going to have a great weekend. There we go. The C's and the O's look very close together, so I've got to be real careful and pay close attention to what I'm doing. I mean, how could that go wrong, right? Debbie, pay attention. Come on. We'll give it our best. Last day of the month. Tomorrow is June 1st. Whew. There we go. I'm taping this actually on a Sunday. Oh, no, on a Monday. It's actually Memorial Day. Lost all track of days. But you'll get to see it on a Friday, so. And there we go. Tonight after dinner, I'll relax for a little while and then come back into my office and start taping videos for this coming week. I like to batch tape, that's what I call it, batch filming. And it just gives me the chance to get everything uploaded onto YouTube for the rest, you know, for the full week. And this way, we don't have to worry about it. love it. Judy, whenever she films, if she does a daily filming, she likes, she likes the concept of filming, you know, um, batch filming, but when it comes to execution, it usually ends up she'll film it the day before she wants to air it so because for her life gets in the way things different projects you know household responsibilities and such and work and stuff get in the way so she ends up having to film it not last minute but she doesn't get the chance that I do on the weekends to um, dedicate to, you know, a couple hours to film. But if you do have that chance and you're able to do it, it really, I love it. Because this way I don't have to scramble to make sure that it's filmed and up because it's already done. And it was only a few hours out of my day. We're going all the way up his back. Why not, right? I have the color out. Might as well do it. 
let's see here. Yeah, we'll put these two. These two are stuck together, so that's where you'll live. Together. Yeah, the C's and the O's are both blue, and they're both the sig the um, symbol is very close. So I've got a really, really, so far I think I'm doing okay. There we go. So far I think I'm doing okay. I film this on an angle, so sometimes it makes it a little difficult to make sure that it's spot on where it should go. Do, do, do. There we go. So yeah, I'll start doing some filming tonight. And then uh, tomorrow, most likely, or Sunday, I'll finish and then get it all uh, edited and uploaded. With my new computer that I have, oh my gosh, it's so blazing fast. It takes me no time at all to uh, to get the thumbnails made and get the videos uploaded and attach the intro music and the outro music and then upload it to YouTube. It really is blazing fast where it took quite a while with my old computer. Don't get me wrong, I still have that computer. I'm keeping that computer because it's a great little computer, but it was old and it was just really bogged down no matter what I did to try to help it. It just, it was so super slow. And for my new job, I really needed something faster. So Todd actually found on Walmart, he found a company that does refurbished computers. And that's what we got. And I already had a monitor from an older computer system that we had. And I use that. It works out great ticks all the boxes that I needed it to tick, and then some. Let's see here, anything else up here? I'm just gonna stop at his neck area. Yeah, I don't think I need any more C's. Uh, one more. I see one more that I need. Here we go, right here. Oh, a couple more, okay. There we go, where are you, right here, okay. There. Now we can start on the letter O. Let's see here. There we go. And we'll work for another five minutes or so. And then we'll call it a day. There we go. I might not be able to finish the whole tail today. I don't know. I'll try. You know, even though there's some, this is almost to me, almost like color blocking. There's a little bit of uh, confetti in here, but it's a nice mixture of both, which I like. I'm not a big fan of confetti heavy projects. I'm more of a color blocking kind of gal. Um, you know, I know people out there that don't mind either way. They don't mind squares or drill or rounds. Well, I have my preferences. I prefer a round. I prefer things that are a little more color blocking, a little less confetti, but that doesn't mean I won't work on confetti. And, uh, but those are my preferences, you know. Uh, lots of people don't mind either way. And that's awesome. I like my rounds and I like my color blocking. I only multi-place with a four-placer. That's my that's my happy multi-placer size. Anything above that, I usually mess it up. It usually comes out all cattywampus on me. Here we go. 
another few more minutes. I might have this tail finished. Hey. When I'm not yammering away, I work much faster on it. <laughs> it's when I flap my gums a lot that I slow down a little bit. But I seem to be working out a nice little balance of flapping my gums and placing drills. I'm getting there, friends. I'm a work in progress. I'll always be a work in progress. There you go. There. Let me just, uh, I'll throw a little bit more in here and try to work a little bit more. I got a couple more minutes left with you. Just a couple. And then I'm going to call it quits and start my weekend. Move that one over just a skosh. There we go. Oopsie. There. This is really a pretty picture. For as nice as it looks on film, on the camera, it looks just as nice in person. And I'm so pleased with it. And you know, friends, right there, I think that's where we're going to... We're going to end today's video. I am so pleased with the way this is coming out. We did quite a bit today. That's awesome. We got most of that tail done. We got all of the... the the dark blue for the letter C done on the bird, so that's neat. We did quite a bit. I'll bring you back up, going up. Thank you. And there we go. He is so cute. There we have it, my friends. Well, that rounds out another week. Our first full official week of working on our birdhouse, our little wooden plaque. I want to thank you all so much for stopping by and spending some time with me, keeping me company while I worked on this. We will catch up again on Monday and start back up on this beautiful bird. Until I see you all again, friends, please remember, hit that like button, comment, leave me a comment, let me know what you're working on, let me know how you're doing, and please consider hitting that subscribe button and hitting that bell notification. You'll be notified each and every time I upload a video. And until I see you all again, God bless, have a wonderful weekend, take care, and happy crafting. Bye now.